Good morning everyone. This is Dweria Talib, PGT Mathematics from TSMS Muttrash Palli Gajwe. Today we are discussing the topic surface area of a sphere. Before we start the topic, the given below are few objects which are very much known to you. Let us identify the figures. The first one is a bankel, a ball and third one is marble. Are the shapes of these circular objects same or not? People generally get confused regarding their shapes. The first one that is a bangle is a circle whereas the ball and marbles are in the shape of a spear. What is the difference? A bangle will be in the shape of a circle whereas a spear, a ball is in the shape of a spear. Of course, both circle and spear will have the set center and, the, fr and fr the distance from the center to the boundary of a circle or from the distance or in case of a spear, the distance between the center and the boundary, the distance is radius and in both the cases, circle and spear, the radius will be same. Still, these two objects are not equal, are not same. The circle is considered is a two-dimensional object. It will have only two axes, whereas a spear will ha have three dimensions that is x, y and z. The bulging part that is considered as the third axis. So, a circle can be drawn on a flat surface whereas a sphere at is, as it is a three dimensional can be drawn by representing the three axes. Sphere in our daily life we come across different objects with our, which are in the shape of a sphere like many fruits, many vegetables, different types of balls all are in the shape of a sphere. Now, what is the surface area of a sphere? Let us understand this with an activity. A tennis ball is taken and that is wind with the help of a string with the help of a pins so that it is not disturbed and the mark the this string starting and end points are marked and slowly the string is removed from the surface of the spear this string is arranged in a proper sorry this string is arranged on four circles which are the same as the radius of the sphere. So while doing this activity what we observe it is that the string which have completely covered the surface area of sphere has been used to completely fill the area of four circles all have the same radius as of sphere. So therefore, from this you can conclude that the surface area of a sphere is four times the area of the circle. So which is four into where the area of a circle is pi r square. So the circumference of a sphere is four pi r square where r is the radius of the sphere. As a sphere has no edges and no vertices, there is no curved surface area or total surface area in case of a sphere. You will have only surface area. Let us go through a problem. If the radius of a spherical ball is 7 cm, find the length of the leather sheet required to make such a spherical ball. 
So it given is the radius of the sphere which is 7 cm and the surface area of a sphere is 4 pi r square. So substituting the value of r and pi we are getting it as 4 into 22 by 7 into 7 and 7. A numerator and denominator 7 will get cancelled, will get the value as 6.6 cm square. Therefore, the leather sheet required to make a spherical ball of 7 cm as radius is 6.6 cm square. So, what we have discussed? Differences between circle and sphere. The dimensions of circle and sphere and the surface area of a sphere. Hope you have understood the topic well. Thank you.